today we're going to create a form and plan plus online and integrate it into your website. Go ahead and go to Form Builder, create new, type in a name for your form and a description if you so desire. And select the type of form you'd like to create. For this example, we're going to choose contacts and you can assign it to whoever you like. In the email notification field, type in the recipient's email address. Each additional email address is simply separated by a comma. And click Create New. The next page will give you a various other options if you desire. We'll go to the next page. Go to the right under the Fields tab. And we're going to add a field. We'll call this one First Name. We're going to map it to First Name, make it required. And you see it'll show up as an element to the left. Next we're going to add last name. Once you have finished creating all your form fields, Click on the HTML tab to your right. We're going to go to the hosted side. Click on reload the standard sample HTML code and it'll refresh the code here. Okay, then click on the form design wizard to your right and a pop-up will appear with preset designs for your form. So go ahead and pick one that's closely related to your current website design. Um, you can or your web developer can uh, modify it to make it look exactly. Once you select it, you can actually um, change the title. You type the title there and, and refresh it. It'll appear over to your right. And when you're done, just hit the button. And go ahead and click on the return page. And here you can uh, type in some just regular HTML. I'm gonna click on the wizard and here's some preset ones that just display thank you on a blank HTML page. Go ahead and select the one you want and uh, click update and it will automatically insert the code in for you. And then hit submit. Now if you wanted to actually the return page redirect to a specific page on your website, click on the return page again and then actually type in the URL you would like your uh, form to redirect to once it's been filled out and submitted. And once you're liking everything, you gotta go ahead and change the status to published. Right, and then select who you like the form to assign to, submit that. We're gonna go ahead and click on the client side. And then we're gonna select the code. You can either send this to your developer or um, paste it in HTML of your website yourself. So we're going to paste it in and we're going to update the file. Okay, and there's the form on your website. And let's go ahead and fill it out, make sure it works. Click Submit, and redirect to the current page. 
go back to your plan plus and then we're going to go ahead and go to contacts and there is your new contact right there That concludes this Plan Plus Online video tutorial. Thank you for watching.